Hey guys, um, I went shopping again. I do this quite a lot. Um, you're gonna see quite a lot of these videos. So here is what I got, yay! Um, my changing bag, which I got on my toddler's worn, finally started to break. So I need a new bag, which was um, big, enough for me to put loads of stuff in, and had straps. So this is my new bag. Ooh, lovely. Lovely pocket at the front, big enough for a Kindle. Loads of pockets on the inside there, and a zip pocket. Really, really long extendable straps. Probably not big enough to fit um, like A4 books in there, so probably not big enough for school, but, and hopefully none of you will need this. Absolutely perfect, it's a changing bag. And really cute. So, yeah, I'm a big fan of this bag, I love it. I've also got some sciencey things as well because can't resist. Um, PH paper, yeah, I know it's not very exciting, but I'm planning on doing exciting things with it. And I have decided my beaker, my massive beaker, is where I'm going to put all of the sciencey things, all of the ideas for videos, all of the stuff that I have for videos that I haven't made yet. So, um, in here already, I have some. And little jars that I got from, little bottles that I got from Primark. This is the only one that I have left because I've kind of destroyed the other one. So I need to go back to Primark and get like loads of these. Um, so I'll just put that gently back in there so I don't destroy another one. Um, and then the pH paper can go in as well. Fun, Cartesian diver. Um, this is a really great way to teach pressure, so I'm going to make a video all about that. You can see the little thing bobbing up and down. So in the jar, beaker. Oh, new eyelash curlers. Um, obviously not sciencey at all, but an essential. Everyone should have a good, decent pair of eyelash curlers. Um, some silica gel. Again, not very interesting at the moment, but is going to be used for um, doing some experiments where I need to have a, a water-free atmosphere. So, they going in the beaker. Some HB pencils. Um, no, not HB pencils. These are two H pencils. These are special pencils that um, you can, when you draw on them on paper, the graphite in there um, is such that it will conduct electricity. So you can draw your circuit, actually put a battery and a bulb in place, and it will act as an electrical circuit. So, special fancy pencils for doing that. And again, going in the beaker. These might look a bit weird, but last time I got some gallium and these are teaspoon moulds so I can make some gallium teaspoons, which is going to be a lot of fun in the beaker. Magnetic putty, um, with a little magnet in there, again this is going to make this is going to make a really really fun video. Um, I'm anticipating doing lots of uh, slow motion stuff with this, so this, this should be a good little fun thing in the beaker. Lemon clock, um, I don't know which fruits or which vegetable is going to make the best clock. So I'm going to find out and test them all. Any ideas, any suggestions for ones you want me to suggest, um, test, just, just put them down below and I'll add them to my list. I can still like a whole range from like a little grape up to a watermelon, which I can stick this in and we can see what happens. periodic table colouring book um yeah honestly I'm a bit disappointed it's a little bit basic I got my husband the microbiology colouring book and there are some beautiful beautiful detailed drawings in here and here I get to colour in a magnet yes um, so I'm a bit disappointed with um, the pictures in this. They're not 
as detailed, as beautiful as the um, biology colouring books, but it is the only chemistry colouring book I could find, so if you know of any other ones, then just, again, pop me a link down below and I'll have a look at them and see what I can do. But, for the moment, it's going in the beaker. And then I had to get myself a nice little set of colouring pencils to go with it. Oh, and just picked up Benefit's new um, Goof Proof Brow Pencil. Um, yeah, you know, he doesn't need a good brow pencil. Really, really pretty, kind of like a, a little magnetic, um, little magic wand there. It's not focusing. Kind of like a little mag magic wand. Oh, not a screw, it's a pull. And then you can twist it up. So that is... That's really nice. I'll let you know what I think about that one. That doesn't go in the beaker. <laughs> um, okay guys, so that's what I bought this month. Um, do another one next month. And stay tuned for videos with the experiments. Bye guys.